Hey guys, welcome to practice. My name is Neil Seligman. I'm the author of 100 Mindfulness Meditations and Conscious Leadership. And today I wanted to offer a practice to help us cultivate happiness and optimism through lockdown. So there's obviously a lot of anxiety and stress and worry around in our world at the moment. And that's only natural. There are big events taking place and it's different. Our lives look and feel very different uh, than they once did. Mindfulness is really useful because it allows us to drop into some of those more difficult aspects. But on the other side of it, it also reminds us to savour the aspects of our life that are sweet, things that we can be grateful for, things that we can generate a sense of appreciation for. And I think the sense that I have is that it, this practice, this practice of cultivating joy and happiness, gratitude and appreciation is just as needed now as is the other side of developing a skill of being with those difficult aspects of our emotional world. So this is a practice for happiness and optimism through lockdown. If you'd like to join me, uh, just find a comfortable position and if it's appropriate for your situation, just allow the eyes to close. We're going to drop in on the breath. So just feeling the breath as you welcome it into the body through the nose, sitting comfortably, inviting the body to find alignment. Noticing the inhale and the exhale. Allowing yourself to be curious about the physical sensations of the breath as it enters the body, guiding our way into the body. As the breath drops in, awareness drops into. And awareness just dissolves through the body, like ink moving through water. Allowing us to connect with the energy of vitality and life within this breathing body. The body and the breath are anchors of our mindfulness practice because they're alive in this present moment. So just feeling that sense of life moving through you, remembering that over three and a half billion years, life has found a way on this planet. Breathing that truth into your body Feeling it through every cell. Noticing as an individual that your track record for getting through tough days is 100% so far. Noticing some of the resources in your body and being that got you through those difficult moments. And just connecting with them now, feeling them as part of your makeup, your resources, your gifts. And perhaps just turning your mind to one thing that made you smile in the last 24 hours. Perhaps it was about hearing about the 100 year old Captain Tom, who's completed 100 laps of his garden, raising over 18 million pounds for the NHS. Perhaps it was the smile of a stranger. Perhaps it was the feeling of the sun warm on your skin you manage to get outside for some exercise. And just allowing that memory of something small that made you smile to return. 
feel the warmth of that again. So notice these little beauties in our day. And not to skip over them, but to savour them. Give ourselves permission to enjoy our lives as best we can. To know that we do no disservice to others by finding those moments of joy, feeling those smiles, allowing the happiness to be felt in the body and being. This is the human spirit alive in you. This is life. And as we notice the feeling of life in our body, we notice how we're connected through that vibration of life to all others. We feel ourselves in this moment as a species, as one humanity. We find ourselves as a global society in a global predicament. And notice all the ways in which we are caring for ourselves and for each other. As we feel that sense of life moving through us, through our communities, through our species. And we remember three and a half billion years life will find a way. Breathing your breath. Feeling the energy of life in you on the breath. Perhaps setting an intention to take your practice with you into your next moments, into the days ahead. And in your very own time, allowing your eyes to reopen. Thank you so much for joining me in practice today. I hope you enjoyed that practice. Return to it any time if you found it helpful. And do check out the other practices on my YouTube channel and also on Instagram TV. I'll see you next time. Bye.